Hello, hello, hello. How are you today on this Wednesday? It is, it's only 3.44, but it is so dark and gloomy out there. This time change is just killing me. Yes, darling, yes. Of course he wants to say hello. Say hello. <laughs> I just thought I'd do a really quick video because I want to do an, an unboxing. Yes, we're going to do an unboxing. Um, I know we talked about those 100, and, or was it 520 um, colored pencils, but um, there was also by the same company, 120 set of um, pencils, the square ones. And I was like, I don't know, um, but I was going through Amazon. I was on there doing something and they were, I saw a little, you know, those little coupon buttons said 20% off. I literally got them for like $24. I figured $24, 120 colored pencils. Um, there were some good reviews. Uh, there were some so-so reviews, but I figured, you know, um, I do have a, a one big pencil, just plain colored pencil set that I got um, like maybe 2017, 18 from uh, uh, years and years ago like 2017 um on something came up on facebook it was like um let's paint let's paint or something like that let's do art or i don't know what something before i even knew that there was like sketch boxes and stuff sketch you know all these um subscription art supply boxes and stuff and oh let's do art i think that's what it was called it was a monthly thing and i did it for like two months and um i got colored pencils from them and um they're okay but um i don't they were not a name brand that i know of now they don't even have a name on them so this i think this will be fine for a colored pencil set i do have um a, a faber castell watercolor pencil set i'm not really into pencils colored pencils and stuff like that so um Maybe this will get me more into it because I do follow um, Winsy Wyrick, the frugal crafter. And she does do a lot of stuff with pencils. Um, Tamara, Tamara Laporte, when I do a lot of her classes, she does do a little colored pencil over um, watercolor or um, acrylics and things like that too, just to do to accent and highlight stuff and do some shading they also do that with in botanical art and i have a lot of botanical art books that i really want to get back into and stuff too so and i also i'm i decided i'm going to sneeze now this happens every time i turn on the video excuse me <coughs> that was a sort of suppressed sneeze I'm sorry <laughs> i also decided i'm not going to look like a freaking hobo anymore when i do my videos so i look a little better now see i used to curl my hair every day just about when I worked in an office. Those days are gone. I've been working from home. I was working from home for 11 years. <laughs> Messy bond girl. So um, I don't want to look like a hobo anymore. So um, let's switch things around and let's unbox this pencil set. Okay. Come on. Come with me. Oh my goodness. I was just reminded of one of my most favorite lines in the book Wild by Cheryl Strayed. I am not a hobo. <laughs> if you don't, if you have not read the book, and if you have the read the book or saw the movie, you know that line. I am not a hobo. <laughs> if you haven't read the book, it's about Cheryl Strayed, who, how she hiked the Pacific Crest Trail. And, of course, you know, that takes months and you are uh, dressed in your hiking gear for, and you are out in the woods for weeks and weeks and weeks of time, days at a time, and you don't shower, blah, 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 blah. Read the book. It is an excellent book. About, I, I've read so many books about through hiking that I have blisters on my feet after you finish this book. <laughs> so here we go. And this is heavy. This is very heavy. Oh, more plastic. Let's see. This is very heavy. Uh, for $24, I can't really say it can't go wrong here. Sorry about the crinky. Some of you might like that noise. 120 Brut Funer Oily Colored Pencils. 
this looks, ooh, this is very nice. This feels very nice. I think I'll just keep them in here as well. And here is our um, swatch list. Oh, here and here is, are the colors, which is nice. Celandine Cognac Autumnal Chicory Coffee Mink. Oh, I like these. I like the names. Cayenne Jasmine Green Arcadia. Ooh, Slew Esther Harbor Blue. I like those names. Interesting. I'll do something with names one of these days. But um, that looks nice. Now, um, that's right. These are square. Very interesting. And the names are on there. And the number. Um, some of the um, reviews that I've seen, uh, there was Chinese writing here. So I like that the names are on here. I like Arcadia. I always wanted to go to Arcadia. I at least made it to Maine. And this is nice because um, there's these little things, uh, these little uh, elastic things to lift. Oh, you know, I just love the colors. The colors are wonderful. Oh, so um, I'm just not really into colored pencils, but I will. Oh, now this is like my favorite. This is my favorite pan. The muted colors, the grays, the neutrals. This is like my favorite pan. I think I'll put this one on top. <laughs> oh, yes. Very nice. Very nice. I am not going to swatch these on camera, but I will swatch them. Um, so another thing I want to test out, well, let's test out some colors, shall we? Let's see, let's do, uh, what is this? This is, Slate. Ooh, slate. Interesting. This is watercolor paper. Maybe that's too, um, here. let's do something that's doesn't, it's not as, oh, that's nice. Light. Oh. Let's do uh, medinal medinal blue. Oh, that's nice. Okay, go from dark to light. Nice. Um, you know what I'd like to do is I'd like to try that. And um, I like the long point when I do do the color. This, you know, this won't even go in there. This will not even go in the first for my long point. Nope, it won't even go into this sharpener. Let's try, let's try this one. It will definitely won't go in the little one. Well, nope, it will go in here. So I'm gonna have to get a different, Pencil sharper, maybe. Ooh, look at that. It does, ooh, it does have a nice long <laughs> shred, but I'm not crazy about that point. You know, I really wanted to do the long point and it won't go in there. What about this one? No, that's too, oh. Uh, I'm going to have to buy a separate, I'm going to have to get a separate pencil sharpener now just to sharpen these. I do, I mean, it'll sharpen through here. Well, I like a long point, so I guess I'm going to have to up my game on, um, what do you call this? I'm going to have to up my game on a sharpener. And I will do that. I'll put sharpener, uh, a really good sharpener on my on my list 
of things to get when I do my new desk. Um, if you have any um, suggestions on a sharpener that you feel would be good, because I have no idea, I would love any suggestions. Please put in the comments. That would be very helpful to me. I do like this. They are nice. Uh, interesting. Let's try, um, let's try. Nice. And then to go to light. And then let's try. A little shading. Interesting. There's your green. Very interesting. My only thing is, um, I'm just disappointed that I can't sharpen them the way I want. Yes, GX, I know you're disappointed too. I know. I know. I know it's almost TV time. We still have three more minutes. <laughs> okay. God, it got really dark out there, but it's the sun is supposed to set like around five, and it's two minutes to four. Hang on there, mister. Hang on. Just hang on there. So I will have to um, swatch these, and, um, and then I'll get back to you on this. I don't know if I should swatch these and then add to the end of this um, video. Um... I'll do a separate video for swatching because I just wanted to get this real quickly out to you. Um, and then on watercolor paper, that's how that looks. I don't think I'll be using these on watercolor paper because I would like to do botanical stuff and things like that. So I'll do that. I have, um, let's try, let's try this. This is Canson XL. Oh yeah, I like that. Very different. interesting um i don't know enough about colored pencils to really give you a good a professional <laughs> um review but i did want to just show you and unbox these see i'm trying to go to light uh, interesting maybe if i did let's see what does white do Hmm. That's that. How about um, brown? Interesting. Well, I guess in my future videos of these colored pencils, um, I'll be learning and you can follow along with me as I learn. If you're learning, that's 100% wonderful. And if you are um, uh, well-versed in colored pencils, please do not hesitate. Just give me comments. I love comments because I'm all, this, this is all new to me. I've only been um, doing art for a little over a year. So that's why I like to share this with you. And I want you to share with me as well. Um, I, I love suggestions, things like that. And what are your favorite colored pencils that you like better than, we all know, this is like a, probably student grade. But hey, look at all those colors. And for $24, not bad. Thank you for being here. I'll talk to you later. Uh -huh.